Hello everyone and welcome back to Bitcoin Tips. So today we're going to be talking about how you can mine Avalanche Coin using your CPU or GPU on a Windows based computer in less than 10 minutes here in March of 2024. So if all of that sounds interesting to you, I do want to make sure to ask you to stick around through the entire video as there are a ton of key points that I want to make sure you don't miss, as well as how you can earn more Avalanche Coin faster using this program. So before we dive into the video today, I do always like to start off here on CoinMarketCap, just taking a look at what's going on in the market as a point of reference if you are watching this video in the future. So if you aren't interested in the market update, feel free to skip ahead one to two minutes and we'll be diving into the program then. But as you can see here, it has been another really good day for crypto across the board. Overall, we are getting very close to that $3 trillion market cap sitting around 2.77 at the moment, up about 2.5% today. Of course, Bitcoin is pretty close to that overall market cap percentage, being up about 2.37% today and over 11% this week. Very close to that 1.5 trillion mark for Bitcoin, of course, hitting new all time highs, depending on when you look at it, but in the low to mid 70,000 range, currently 73,000. So, very, very cool. Ethereum over 4,000 again. Binance, $624. They've been doing awesome lately. Uh, Solana, XRP, again, both doing very well. But of course, we are taking a look today at Avalanche. Now, Avalanche Coin, again, doing very well. Maybe not so much on the day, still up about 0.3%, but over 30% this week. 54.99 right now for Avalanche. So, a lot more people are taking note of this coin which is currently number 10 on the coin market cap. Uh, but of course, this is a pretty good week chart and looking at their one month chart doing very very well. So, more people getting interested in this coin and with everything else in crypto indicating that we are getting started in a bull market, having some avalanche now would be a great thing to have in your portfolio because as we start to see prices go up, if you already have it and you've earned it at $54 and it gets to $100 or $200, wherever you think it might go, you know, its previous all time high here around $125. 150 or 134 you know if you think it's going to get all the way back up there the more you can get at this price the better so that leads us really well into today's video so like i said we are taking a look at how you can mine this coin using your cpu or gpu on a windows computer in 2024 now a lot of people will usually say well mining with gpus isn't profitable anymore or you have to have a really powerful one and yes you know depending on where you are what your electric costs are it may not be profitable at the moment to mine avalanche or really any other coin but if you truly believe in the coin and think it's going to go up and you're willing to pay that power out of pocket you can mine this coin now with that being said there are a lot of gpus that are still profitable to mine on different algorithms you just need to know which one is the best and for that i recommend checking out whattomine.com if you go to this website it's actually a very good site that shows you depending on the hardware that you have what the most profitable algorithm and coin to mine is based on your personal setup so while i can't tell you what the most profitable is for your setup this site is really good and I know for most people, it's probably going to be the Kapow algorithm or Pyron hash. Uh, depends on which one you know your setup is best with. But here's where we get started on Avalanche. So if you come to Unminable, and the link is down in the description below, I do highly recommend that you use that link down below if you are thinking of starting mining anything here on Unminable, as it does have a discount code built in, which we'll talk about here in just a minute. But if you wanted to follow along, that link is down below. So go ahead and find this button that says getting started with our wizard. This is the easiest way to get started. And as you can see here over the next two or three minutes, we will be up and mining in five minutes or less. But go ahead and choose basic. If you're mining with GPU, of course, choose GPU. There is also a CPU option. 
the uh, process doesn't really change for CPU, it's just different algorithms. And of course you're choosing CPU here. But I'm using a 2080, so we're gonna go with the GPU. Personally for me, I do know that Kapow is one of the better algorithms for my computer. So here's where you would choose what your best algorithm is, but for me, I'm going with Kapow. You choose your coin, Avalanche, paste in your address. Now I will say, I do like to stop for a minute here on the address page and just say a disclaimer that please, please, please make sure this address is 100% correct. While you will be able to mine with the file that this program creates, if your address is wrong, you will not be able to get paid and any coins you mine to this address will not be able to be paid out. You can always come back in and change and build a new file with a new correct address, but you will not be able to get anything that you mined to this address. So do make sure it is correct. And down here, if you don't have an Avalanche, you can, uh, or an Avalanche wallet that is, you can create a MetaMask wallet, Trust wallet, and get some uh, FAQs answered right here. At this point, you can go ahead and say next. And here is where you would put in the referral code. It may already be filled in if you used the link down below, but in case it's not, the link is down below and then below that will be the referral code. It does help out the YouTube channel here, but it also helps out you in that it reduces your pool fee. So as you can see here, regularly without a uh, referral code, you are paying 1% of everything you mine to the platform. But if you use the referral code, you'd only be paying 0.75%. So it does help out your mining and it does help out the channel as well. Of course, you don't have to use it, but you'll be you know, earning less coins if you don't. So that is down below as well. For the tutorial, I'm gonna continue without one. At this point, you are pretty much done. There's two final things you need to do. Uh, one of those is picking a mining program. Now for me, I personally like Gminer. It's worked really well for me. I have no complaints with it. And it supports both Nvidia and AMD. If you do choose another miner, make sure that it's compatible with your equipment. Team Red, of course, is only for AMD. T-Rex is only for Nvidia. Just wanted to call that out as well. But what you'll have to do is once you choose a miner, click on download miner files. This will take you to the GitHub where you do have to download the Windows 64 zip of the miner. Once that's downloaded, go ahead and extract those files. And the last and final step here is downloading the .bat file. This will download into your downloads folder, and then you will have to go ahead and drag and drop it into the same folder that you extracted with the mining program. So at this point, you are pretty much ready to get started mining. Now, what I will say here is when you go to download this .bat file, you will get an error from Google Chrome that says it's an unverified file and you will have to allow it to download. So if you're not comfortable with that, then unfortunately, you're going to get this with any coin that you mine. Really, it's just part of it. Um, I've never had an issue, but of course, it's your computer, your decision. Now, the second part to that is when you go ahead and double click this here, you're gonna see that Windows uh, Defender actually pops up here. Again, you're gonna have to say more info and run anyways. If you are not comfortable doing this, then don't. Uh, you know, it's just part of mining. These programs do very similar things to what regular real viruses do, so they are often flagged by Windows Defender and other antivirus programs. So with that being said, once you've let it through, you can go ahead and hit run anyways, and it will pop up and start mining. At this point, we are about eight, nine minutes into the video, and as you can see, we are up and mining Avalanche Coin in 2024 using a Windows-based computer and a NVIDIA RTX 2080. So it is really that simple to get started mining. Um, just a few other things I do like to mention here is it does take anywhere from you know 15 to 30 or maybe even 60 minutes for your worker information to show up here on the site. Um, so if you go in and search your address, you won't see your worker right away. It does take some time. Don't worry, if everything in the mining program is green, there's no red errors, it should show up. Give it some time and it should populate. And that also goes for when you stop the miner. To stop the miner, all you have to do is hit X and if there's no CMD window open on your taskbar, the miner is stopped. 
Oftentimes you will see your worker stats continue to report on the site for up to an hour. With that being said, the miner stopped. You can use your computer, you can turn it off, but you may actually still get a little bit of payments as it kind of ramps down on the site. So keep that in mind as well. And I always do like to mention that they also have a really nice calculator here. So once you determine what algorithm you're mining, if you go across the top here and select it, uh, like Kapow, you can go ahead and enter in however many hashes you think you might be getting, and it's gonna tell you how many AVAX coins you're going to get. So just like that, it is that simple to start mining Avalanche coin today in 2024 using Windows. So if you do run into any issues with this, please feel free to leave a comment down below. I will do my best to help support and get your mining program up and running. And again, if you are thinking of mining this coin or any other coins here on Unminable, please do consider using the referral code down below. It helps us both out. Uh, and more crypto in your wallet is better for when the bull run gets here. So thank you so much for watching. Please make sure to like, share, and subscribe to Bitcoin Tips to stay up to date on all things crypto. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.